When I was seven years old, I went to Legoland and Disneyland. We drove to California all the way from Calgary in 31 hours. That trip was incredible. I remember getting funny looks from the Americans when we went to the beach. We were swimming and people thought we were crazy. My dad stepped on a stingray and ran so fast out of the water and squealed like a little girl. I remember the trip so well because it was in the middle of my cancer treatments. Half a year earlier, we found a soccer ball sized tumor in my torso. I couldn't lay down because it restricted my breathing and squished my organs. I am surprised I didn't lose any parts of my organs. I had to do chemo in my spine, radiation in, in my brain, and dialysis and bone density scans. A lot of the needles we called magic milk. It put me to sleep right away. For some reason, the doctors are really interested in my blood, like vampires. It's a little creepy. One of the doctors, Dr. Le Fay, is French, and she is hilarious, and her accent is awesome. She taught me some French. Now I'm working on my own Scottish accent. One of the things that happened because of chemo is that I broke my back and neck, sitting on the couch, being a lazy bum. I don't know how that happened, but I had to relearn to walk. I still can't walk long distances or play sports, but I can longboard like a boss. I've never wiped out yet. Sometimes I'm shy about cancer. I don't really tell my friends about it because I don't want them to worry. When I went back to school in grade three, all the kids were worried that they would catch cancer from me. I am now living life as a YouTuber, making lots of good friends, like Brendan Hill, Micah Ernest, and Bryce Howard. They're all my gaming buddies and best friends. I like my friends and skateboarding and gaming. Life is pretty good.